Desalination by kscience.com. In this video, we're going to learn about how purifying seawater can provide us with water that is safe to drink. The earth has a lot of water. Roughly 71% of its surface is covered with water. Although there is a lot of water, 97% of that water is ocean water. And ocean water contains a lot of salt, which is not safe to drink. The other 3% is locked in fresh water. This is water found on land and contains small amounts of salts and is generally safer to drink. Ocean water contains too much salt. Salty water is not safe to drink. To make salt water safe to drink, a process called desalination is used. To carry out this process, you need a container full of seawater. You then burn a fuel to heat the seawater. A second container is also needed where you cover both containers with a plastic sheet. As the seawater is heated, evaporation takes place where the liquid water turns into a gas and rises upwards. As the water vapour rises upwards, it gets further away from the heat source and then when the water vapour touches the plastic sheet, it starts to condense it from a gas into a liquid. As the water droplets become larger and larger, they flow down the plastic sheet where they flow into the container. So by this stage, the water has condensed from a gas into a liquid, forming pure water in the second container, containing no dissolved salts. The salts do not evaporate as their boiling point is too high. They remain in the first container. It's question time. Attempt these questions to check your understanding. Desalination is a process used in hot, dry countries with very little access to fresh water. These countries will use desalination to provide clean water that is safe to drink to millions of people. And there are many problems associated with this which we will now consider. Desalination uses lots of energy which requires us to burn a lot of fossil fuels. The combustion of these fossil fuels causes lots of CO2 emissions which contributes to climate change. The whole process of desalination can also be expensive, costing lots of money. However, there are some benefits associated with desalination. Hot, dry countries use it, giving them the opportunity to provide their people with fresh drinking water, especially if they have lots of oil and a sea nearby. Pause the video here. To practice the keywords, the answers will follow. Press pause to answer the questions. The answers will follow. If stuck, just rewatch the video. Press pause to go through your answers and make any corrections to your mistakes. And don't forget to visit kscience.com for more videos, worksheets and quizzes at kscience.com and don't forget to like and subscribe.